really captures the essence of managing self. There's a quote that says that between stimulus and response, there is a space. And it is in that space that our power to choose and response comes. In our response lies our growth and freedom. Now let's consider that space between stimulus and response. Something happens and then there's a reaction. But there's a space, there's a tiny space between that stimulus and that reaction. Very small space. You might miss it if you are not aware. But it allows you to pause. And what do you insert in that pause will determine how much you have grown and it will determine your freedom. Your growth and your freedom lies within that space. Measure what happens every time you are stimulated, every time somebody annoy you, piss you off, say something you don't like, rub the chalk on the, on the blackboard or drag their foot on the um, floor, that shoe that screechy and it gets on your nerves. Every time something happens, every time that trigger is pulled, imagine what happens when you are stimulated between that time and the time you respond. And if you go from stimulus to reaction without that pause, you are not managing self. There is a pause, and that pause is so important. Slow down, slow down. Practice the pause. That is a powerful pause. Bite your tongue if you have to. Do whatever it takes, but pause. Pause it's going to make a huge difference. If you find yourself or you know people who stimulus reaction, stimulus reaction, and this is how they live their lives, they are not managing self. And this is one of the best way to know if you are managing self. Insert that pause, practice it. The next time you are stimulated, instead of reacting, pause formulate your response and then you react it's going to change your life it's even going to change the way that people see and how they view who you are who did how they determine who you are because they are used to they are used to this jumping jacks and when they start noticing that you are no longer like that it's going to make a huge difference in the way that they see you and the way that you are treated. They might even stop trying to stimulate you because there are those around us who know what our triggers are. They know which button to push in order to get us to react. But if we can control that button and put a pause on it, they may stop. They may say, this is no fun anymore. I'm not getting the reaction that I'm used to. What's the point? 